Alright, today guys, it's going to be a little different video. Um, so we're going to be unboxing my new projector that I'm going to be using in my new setup. So I'm just going to get right to the point. Um, yeah, this is, I'm been, I've been waiting for it for a week because I'm too cheap to get Prime. I got this on Amazon, it's like um, 60 bucks. It's actually a real good price for a pretty good projector. Sexy. Just gotta throw that on the side. All right, so you get two cards. This is your warranty card, and uh, just some bullshit card. And uh, so here is the baby Jesus right here. Okay. And uh, this is your your satisfaction card. Oh no, this is how to clean the projector. This is your humongous ass, humongous ass user guide. You're not going to want to use it, so you just find the quick user manual. Uh, that's probably the quick user manual. So, okay, in our little side box, we're going to keep baby Jesus quiet for now. We have our remote. I like it here. Let me open it. Looks pretty cool. Decent size, just like, almost like an Apple TV remote, except Apple TV is like way cooler. Has a nice matte, nice matte finish. Has your selection, uh, your power, volume up, volume down, no volume, back arrow. Don't know what the fuck these are. And so we're gonna put this to the side. Yo, the the heavy breathing is my cameraman. Um, here's a power cord, standard. It's basically like the same thing they could use for the PS4. I'm not sure. I'm not gonna try it. Um, they also give you a bonus with the free HDMI cord. And, uh, yeah. And also, you have an AV adapter, so you can plug in your old DVD player. And I have a gaming console that can actually plug in. It has an AV connector, so that's perfect. Um, you have this little Chinese stop sign. Um, this is for your projector. It's to hook it up. And now... Baby Jesus is finally coming out of the room. Okay. Sorry for being awkward. Oh, it's kind of heavy. Wow. Good consistency. And here we go. Wow. Beautiful. You have a nice lens cover to protect it. Nice. Yeah, nice lens. I can't wait to be using this, honestly. And, uh... This is your keystone control. It's the focus. Keystoning is basically if you put it, let's say here's the wall, and uh, you put it like right here, you can control it so that it can still have a straight image. And uh, this is basically the same controls that you have on the remote up, down, left, right, okay, power, and uh, back arrow of uh, bullshit. And yeah, and then also. What's crazy about this? I have a headphone jack, so I'm gonna I can uh, plug in my sound system. So I have the AV port. Plug in this. You have the a USB of USB port, an SD card, full SD card, an HDMI, a VGA for all you old people, and yeah. So actually, I wanna just try this out quickly if I can know how to screw things on. Um, So you can have it like at an angle if you want but usually you won't so yeah all right so here is the setup and uh it's crazy the projector's right over there and uh my, i have my playstation hooked up and i have my sound system all hooked up and now we're gonna show you we're gonna demonstrate some awesome fucking ps4 playstation bullshit i, I don't know this is, that did not come out smooth. That did not come out smooth. Alright, yeah, so we're gonna play some Cod World War 2. And this is not gonna be the quality of other videos. He's, it's still gonna be the same exact quality as it usually is. Yeah. I'm gonna be doing, actually, I can finally do videos. Uh, up here. And I'm probably gonna move that, so. Yeah, I'm just gonna do... Multiplayer. 
I'm actually surprised how well it works. Um, yeah, we're just gonna play a bit of COD. Do a quick match. Are you fucking me? Okay, yeah, um, yeah, it's gonna take quickly. Yeah. So, after the update, um, we're gonna play some local play. We're gonna just demonstrate some of our awesome projector. Whatever the fuck that is, honestly. Ooh, is that- oh, that's the French. The war machine. Yeah. Is that an update? Yeah. Oh, I can't wait to play that. Sorry about the shaky video, it's kind of awkward having to hold it at an angle like this. Now this will work even better. Um, How long are you setting this? I can't hold this for very long. Yeah, I know. Like two minutes. How long did you set it? I don't know. Just, just stop the video, I guess. Alright, yeah. yeah, this is, it'll be way better at night time. And I'm getting phone calls. Even the doctor gets phone calls. Yeah. Alright, boys, slow on. You have eyes in the sky. Care package on the way. Protect the drops. Oh, yeah, here we go. Eliminate all access forces. What are you playing? Bring the I'm playing Team Deathmatch. Bring it hard. Oh, I've never played Team Deathmatch. I've always just I've always just played free for all. It's kind of dark, but, but it should be better. Oh yeah, at night time when nothing's coming through, it's going to be great. I'm sure. Yeah, this is literally like first person. Can you fly planes in this? Uh, no. Well, no. You can in the campaign. Yeah. But you haven't, you haven't got there yet. Nope. This try sucks at the campaign. Too bad it's not two player. I would two player it with you. Yeah, it is two player. No, it isn't. It is. No, it isn't. Yeah. All cards are two-player. There's not a two-player campaign. No, there's two-player. Oh, no. I said if there's a two-player campaign. Oh, that would be lit, honestly. They had that on the Halo 4 for the 360. It was fun. It was still kind of kinky, though. Like, the way. The drop it was Why a lot can of... I not find any, uh... Honestly, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.